First, I'd like to uh, point out that uh, although consumer devices uh, has uh, uh, advanced tremendously in the past three decades, as like telephone into smartphones and television sets. Uh, medical devices, in comparison, has not advanced very much. Uh, we, we have uh, fallen behind in terms of uh, the reduction in cost, size, and uh, of course, automation and uh, improvement in usability. Well, with GoCheck Kids, uh, we, we have brought pediatric vision screening from the big box model to the uh, smartphone era. So this is an app that's implemented on a smartphone where a pediatrician or a technician can take a flash photo of a patient, which is a preschool ch child, and the, uh, the image is then analyze automatically with a software that segments the image and provide a diagnostic output to give an instant recommendation on whether the child needs to be referred to a uh, eye care professional. So to date, uh, we have uh, 3,500 pediatric primary care teams using this product. Uh, about three quarter million children have been screened and about 41,000 children with uh, refractive error uh, amblyopia risk factors have been referred to an eye care specialist. So GoCheck Kid uh, dramatically lowers the cost and increases the convenience of photo screening, but it provides uh, uh, the same level of performance as much bigger, uh, more expensive uh, devices. In this uh, peer-reviewed uh, publication, you see that uh, GoCheck Kids has provides uh, at least a similar performance with about 80% uh, uh, sensitivity and more than 90% specificity in detecting amblyopia risk factors. Uh, GoCheck Kids is uniquely positioned to harness the power of artificial intelligence to maximize diagnostic accuracy and the detection of pathology. And this is because we have uh, big data already. We have more than a million images that's been captured, and of these, uh, over 100,000 have been uh, graded by a human expert uh, who no notates the, uh, the presence and the, the size of uh, those crescents in the pupil that signify refractive error, as well as the location of key ocular landmarks. And we also have the ability to be integrated into electronic health records. So we already have very good image processing algorithms, but with this big data, we have the ability to bring it to an even higher level. Our goal is really to close the loop so that after we refer the patient to an ophthalmologist, uh, we further collect the data on, the, uh, on their clinical measurements, diagnosis, and treatment outcome, and feed that back to our uh, diagnostic algorithm through uh, machine learning techniques uh, such as neural network and deep learning. And I think in this way, we can build referral criteria that should be even better than the current expert-based uh, referral criteria by the American Academy of Pediatricians and Pediatric Ophthalmologists. So the key here, of course, is to partner with ophthalmologists and health uh, systems to get the feedback, uh, get the clinical information, and put, pull the big data out of electronic health record uh, systems through integration. So for the pediatric ophthalmologist out there and the, uh, the managers of uh, healthcare systems, uh, I, I ask you to join us, uh, help us uh, bring uh, pediatric vision screening to the next level. Thanks.